Techno Update. Subscribe now. Nexus 5X Review Design The Nexus 5X looks and feels like the Nexus 5 adapted for modern times. It's lightweight and with a 5.2-inch display, my fingers can barely reach all the way across the screen. That's what I want. It pushes the limit of a one-handed phone with dimensions of 147 by 72.6 by 7.9 mm, making it taller and broader, but ultimately skinnier than the idolized phone from 2013. Performance These inconsistent results are what I've seen from the troubled Snapdragon 810 processor, not the purposely slower and theoretically more stable Snapdragon 808 chip. The 5X uses the same with the same Snapdragon 808 processor with a 64-bit hexa-core CPU that's a combined 1.44 GHz quad-core chip and 1.82 GHz dual-core chip. A matching Adreno 418 GPU is also integrated into this processor. Camera The camera sensor here is 12.3 MP, a lower number than its top-performing Android rivals in 2015. But the Nexus 5X is able to, to use that extra light for superior low-light images. A whopping 80% of photos are taken in low-light, according to Google. This rear camera records video in 4K at 30 frames per second, while the front-facing camera is 5MP with the normal 1.4 microns and the same f/2.0 aperture. You can definitely tell the selfie quality between it and the 8MP Nexus 6P camera, though the iPhone 6S, with its retina flash, beats both of them. Battery life. The Nexus 5X battery life gets me through the day with heavy use, and that's about it, which is to say that it's on par with past Google-made phones that have average battery life. It contains a 2,700mAh battery, giving it a nice boost considering the 2,300mAh capacity of the Nexus 5. Alas, running multiple battery life tests shows little has changed.